Welcome back to the Charlotte 49ers Dynasty. We are going into week 12 with a game in Dallas against Southern Methodist University. We are currently 5 and 4 and SMU is 6 and 3. We are 4th in American East and SMU is 1st in American East. Like I mentioned in the last episode with a little bit of help from East Carolina and University of North Texas, we could potentially find our way in the American Conference Championship game. But with our big game last week from none other than Taylor Thompson, nine catches, 100 plus yards, and four touchdowns. Yeah, you heard me. Four touchdowns. Go back and watch the episode. It was great. I want to look at the players of the week because I'm confused. Like I mentioned, nine catches, 100 plus yards, and four touchdowns. And we did not get offensive player of the week. However, you see, Geo Howard did get Defensive Player of the Week. He did have two interceptions, and they were great-looking interceptions. Please go back and watch those. That's pretty frustrating, the fact that we did not get Offensive Player of the Week. So, we'll see if we can replicate that, because like we talked about before, we want that Mackey Trophy for the best tight end in the nation. And Taylor Thompson deserves it. As we look at the team stats before we get into the game, they look middle of the road for both teams. There are a few for us that are some outliers. Um, our defensive points, we are letting up quite a few, and our offensive rush, we are pretty bad. Their defensive rush is pretty bad, so let's hope that we can make sure that Taylor Thompson is the recipient of Red Zone Looks. Let's get into it. There's going to be no surprise here. We're going tails because tails never fails us. Look at SMU's uniforms as they are wearing their Texas Pride uniform package. Having spent time working in Texas before, I do still feel a little bit of pride having had some very shallow roots in Texas, unlike my deeper roots in North Carolina. And just like that, we're giving up a big play right up the middle, and I just completely whiffed on that. It looks like your linebacker who was blitzing just got annihilated, so that's not good. Another big play, my goodness. Oh man, oh my goodness. Wow, Rishi Rice, wow. They had the ball less than a minute. Should have hit the outside, but daggone it. That pass was not on target. That was not even funny. Gashing plays up the middle. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna blitz, we're gonna blitz, we're gonna blitz, we're gonna blitz. There we go, Shadrick Ursary. There we go! Oh, my Marquise Watts, you were so close to getting that sack. So we did a much better job the second drive stopping them. So let's do a better job than our first drive and get more than six yards and get into the end zone. Let's tie this up. I don't want to settle for three. I want to get into the end zone. Eugene Minter with a nice block from Mr. Taylor Thompson. Eugene! See if we can hit this outside, and it looks like we could have if we were a little faster. There we go, Taylor Thompson, right there. That was a nice pass, pretty much right on the mark. Could have led him a little more. I did try to, but I also, well, oh my God, that's so ugly. No, no, oh God. <sighs> And I messed up again. Tanner Mordecai cannot sit back there and pick us apart. It took three guys to make this play. Oh my gosh. I had him dead to rights. <sighs> of course, he broke the first tackle. We are going to change these because I have to tackle the first time. Thank goodness. End of the first quarter, we are losing 7-0. Third and inches. Let's see what they're going to do. Uh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to bring some pressure. Nice stop. Marquise Watts coming in for the big stop. So they are going to be going for it. That's... Very unfortunate. There we go! <laughs> Good job. They tried to do a little funnel screen, but my guys were able to act quick enough and get the stop before they grabbed the first down. That probably should have been picked off. Marquise Watts was running right through it. Do not ever throw across your body, but he was so wide open. A little bit of motion here. 
see if we can make something happen. Let's get to the outside. Good job. That a boy. Nine yard gain. If I can hit this outside, I'm able to. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Just a little faster and we are hitting that corner. It's hard to mess up a slant. Grant Dubose cannot hold on to it. 51 yard field goal. We go for it. Unfortunately, we're going slants again. I know this is kind of a cheesy play, but you got to do what you got to do at times. So who the fudge was that to? For the record, I was throwing it to the left side of the screen trying to hit Elijah Spencer, but it was supposed to be to the guy coming from the left. Oh, Marquise Watts. Oh, that was a nice eye. Good deal. Third and 12. Ran right by it, but it's all good. We stopped him. There we go. Eugene. With another first down catch. There we go. Ooh, I was trying to hit that step back. You daggone it. Uh, this is where I'm, I'm just getting frustrated. Coach wants to go for it. I don't know how I feel about that. There we go. Ta Why would you run backwards? There we go, Marquise Watts. Another sack. Two sacks on the day. Three tackles for loss. Five total tackles. We are not even through the first half. Third and eight. Another missed tackle. That And that's on me. I don't know what was going on. He, he just stopped, and then my guys were just standing around looking at him. So we have three timeouts left. We might be dangerous enough to mess around and find out, you know? I'm going to let this go. I only have one safety, and he's to the right. So Dubose might be a fellow to look at here. Oh, are you? I tried. Obviously, are you kidding me? That a boy, Marquise Watts getting another sack. That's three for the game. Uh, let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. <sighs> Moochie Dixon thought you were making a play at the end of the half. You were wrong. We're going to go into halftime down seven to nothing. Could be much worse, especially having thrown three interceptions. Hopefully the second half will be better. So let's get right to it. We will be receiving the ball. So hopefully we'll be able to get a little momentum. I'll say a little more, but we uh, didn't have any momentum. Hassan Wilson, good job. He can't do everything. Eugene dropped it. I don't know how much that pressure is going to impact me. Thank you, Grant DuBose. Picking up first down. Play action here. The goal, obviously, is to get them into that false sense that we are just going to be running the ball. There we go. Clemens. Big, big catch right there. Was able to put it right on the money, too. The... There we go. There we go. Turn on the boosters. So they are bringing a little bit of pressure. Shoot, shoot. If you would have thrown it when I freaking pressed the button the first time, why did I have to press it twice? It's hard to mess this up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, fellas. Give me this lane. Good job. And McCarron salvaged another touchdown. Siobhan McCarron was the one who came in and just said, nope, I will take that touchdown. So finally... We have tied the game. It is seven to seven. Very uneventful. And you know, if if you like turnovers, then you obviously like my channel. I am so turnover prone. It's not even funny. Oh my gosh, we had him on the run. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I had him right there. I jump, and of course, whatever. Oh God, that to me doesn't make sense. Not enough. What, 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 no, 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 no. I don't even know where my guy was for him to roll over me. We're, we're just going to have to go down and score. What? The, where are you coming from? Like, seriously, dude. Where? I mean, obviously, he was, you know, creeping up in there. I jumped behind him. Go flipping figure. There's plenty of time, so let's just go down, drive down, score a touchdown, and make another stop. We stopped them as well as you know we could, despite our stupid mistakes. All we have to do is, is come in here and, and execute. There we go. Nice way to start the drive. 
There we go. Hit the ball in our playmaker's hands. Let's see if we can score before the end of the third quarter. Hit this, hit this. Oh, there we go, there we go. Get a little bit of speed. Good job. Oh, right at the century mark. Are you freaking kidding me, man? That's not, what? No, no. Are you serious? Five interceptions. Was there another sack? Mark Eswat is putting on a clinic. Let's see who has more sacks or interceptions. So far, Marquise Watts is giving Mr. Reynolds a run for his money. Marquise Watts is having himself a game, man. I don't know if that guy can make this kick, so I do have someone back with hopes that he does miss it. And yeah, he's going to. Sweet. It's staying a two possession game. That was huge. There we go. Playmaker's hands. We're gonna go ahead and go hurry up. We need all the time we can get. There we go, Dubo. Good job. There we go. Hot dog, we got him. <laughs> Taylor Thompson was able to go and get that pass. That was a tight window, and I don't know how Chris Reynolds put it in there because he, like I said, couldn't hit the broadside of a barn. Six plays, 65 yards in 50 seconds. Good job. Taylor Thompson finally getting in the end zone. That was a very dangerous pass. Uh, I've messed up five other times, so why not, you know? This is absolutely huge. because This is where we're going to have to stop them. We need Marquis Watts to come up with another huge sack for us. Good. Oh, my. No, 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 no. Not like this. How are you going to break all those freaking tackles? That's, that's frustration. Tank Robinson having to come up and put a big hit on him. We need the quarterback spy. Look at my guy. Look at Jarrell Holly. Because I was trying to get over there and I was absolutely being held. Oh, God. That irks the ever living out of me. They were banking on me bringing pressure, but I didn't bring pressure. We've shown we can do this very quickly. Woo! There we go. Need big chunks. That a boy. There we go. There we go. That a boy, Taylor Thompson. And you got out of bounds. Oh my God. That safety tricked me. Another touchdown for Mr. Taylor Thompson. Good job, man. Breaking the school record. That's what we have to do. We have to get the ball in our playmaker's hands. We, again, are within one score. Now, let's stop them on this drive. Get the ball back. Score, tie it up, and stop them again. It's that simple, right? It's that simple, right? Right? Secure the tackle. Ooh, Amir Sadiq. <laughs> yes. There we go, guys. We got the stop we needed. Two minutes and 56 seconds. We did use one of our timeouts. We can work down the field and not have to worry about using those timeouts. Oh, I thought Blount was making plays in the open field. Dang on it. We can go back to our play calling and, and run the ball. Oh my gosh. There we go. Go, 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 go. If you were just a tick faster, buddy. There we go, Taylor Thompson. I thought I was going to get sacked. Oh, my heart is beating really fast, guys. Okay, okay. Six yards. Good job. Slot post. I love this play. No, 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 no. No, no. No. I'm so mad. No way. What just happened? I'm, I'm really... Disgusting. That one hurts. Chris Reynolds, uh, almost 300 yards, but you had six interceptions. That's a joke. Shadrick Bird, 108 yards, no touchdowns because it was salvaged by Siobhan McCarron. Taylor Thompson, 10 catches, 150 plus yards, two touchdowns. You did have two drops. Stone Handy led us in tackles, and that was great. Tackles for loss. Marquise Watson, a surprise, also with four sacks. That was awesome. Total offense, um, it, it wasn't pretty on either side, to be honest with you, man. 360 total yards uh, for them, just over 400 for us. They had more uh, rushing yards than us. Uh, we had more passing yards. We were much better on third down. We whiffed on fourth down. 
threw an interception in the red zone. And, and that was me. So with that being said, we could have, should have been tied at 28. And this, this is the killer right here. Interceptions, man. Six. What a joke. With that loss, we do drop to five and five with two games left, one against Temple and one against Memphis. We have to win one of them to become bowl eligible. Let's take a look at how this past week may have impacted the awards given at the end of the year. With another great performance from Mr. Taylor Thompson, he has catapulted from ninth two weeks ago to second last week and now into first with 64 receptions, over a thousand yards and 10 touchdowns. Just two weeks ago, he only had four touchdowns, so we really have made an effort to get him the ball. Join us again for week 13 as we play the third Al mascot team of the year. Let's look to go 3-0 against them. We do have a few big recruits coming, including a quarterback that we desperately need. Maybe we will do a strictly running game so we don't embarrass ourselves and push this quarterback away. Looking forward to welcoming Temple to town to defend the 704. Go Niners!